exhibition in Paris. It's uh, really amazing to be here. It's a beautiful city and I'm so privileged. My work is about life. It's about how life is good and it is bad. And they're not exclusive, uh, intrinsically woven. And so I try to put lightness and darkness and good and bad and the messy and the well done together so that it's like my experience of life and everyone's experience of life. And I'm really interested in women's history. I think, you know, uh, a lot has been achieved for women and when I work I listen to a lot of audiobooks and they're mostly written by women about what women have been through um, in order for us to be here now doing things like selling you know showing our paintings or writing books so I think we owe a lot to the women in the past and I I think to know about the history we can move forward and make the future a better place. <laughs> I saw Danielle's work, uh, the first time I saw it, I think it was on Instagram, if I remember well. And what struck me is the power of this duality between the good and the bad. And this is automatically what drew me to, to her work. Well, I'm always in, interested in books. Um, I always listen to things while I work. I'm interested in human behavior, why people do what they do, um, heretics, uh, people who are outside of the norm, uh, what influences our behavior. Yeah, I have a lot of influences and they all feed into the work. Yeah, well, this work was like the first one. This is called The Triumph of Life and I made it in response to Bruegel's painting, um, A Triumph of Death. Because after the pandemic and all that we've been through, and I saw this painting and I thought, no, death, death's not winning, like we want to live. We changed our life, like we changed how we live so we can survive. We adapted the way we work. Uh, and, and even to think about the virus, the virus mutates to survive, like that's what we do, we change. So it's about accepting change and, uh, and, and life, like wanting to survive, so that, that's this painting. I think it's wonderful, you know, like there's enough room in this world for everyone to do something, you know. And if some people like digital art, that's amazing. You know, let them do it. Uh, it's, it's, it's part of life, you know, we can't ignore the digital world. I haven't done it yet um, because I enjoy paint. I enjoy physical, the physical connection with a canvas. Um, but other people enjoy the physical connection with a computer. So why not? Why not?